Hello, the Pugs Universe. This is the Hoogian Wizard, and welcome back to another video. And I just mucked up my intro spectacularly. Um, but yeah, so welcome back to another video, and welcome back to Minecraft Communities, as we so often do on Saturdays. And I've mucked that up once more, but hey, there we go. Today, I feel we're going to have that as the grand theme. And I don't tell no one going down here. Oh, yeah, to feed the dogs. Um, but today, uh, we're not building anything um, where we normally would be. Today, in fact, we are going to be going to the nether. Um, and that is because uh, what we are going to be building in the next video requires quartz. And I don't have that much quartz. And sorry, doggos, this looks like it's your last bit of food. I need to go on some... Um, animal killing runs I guess um, but yeah let's just go and feed these and then we need to hop back into my house um, and it's gonna be a fun little test to see whether I can remember where the nether portal is in my house um, because I think the quickest way of getting to it would be to go through the secret en uh, entrance down here uh, because I think this takes you to one of those um, like square rooms where like the cross room things are uh, these uh, like the crossroads and is it up here no is it down there no it's not is it in the next one of these rooms it might be um, it's not up there it's not down there is it down here oh no I just oh no it is down here okay there we go um, so I've got like my diamond sword with me, I've got my bow with me and stuff. Um, and yeah, so, uh, and I don't have my shovel in my help bar, there we go. Uh, we probably won't need the shovel, but hey, it's always handy to have. And I've got some dirt on me so we can pile up to places if we need. And I haven't actually been to the nether in this world, or in any world really, in a little while. Um, I'm not entirely sure why, I just sort of haven't really. So yeah, let's jump straight in here, I guess, and let's go off to the nether. And here we are. So, uh, yeah, this was... I can't remember who built this. It wasn't me, I don't think. I think it was Laurie. It might have been Rosie, but I think it was Laurie that built this. Um, yeah, I think it was, because this was where his nether portal was in back when he used to own this, and it was part of his community. Um, and yeah, so that's a lot of fire. So let's carry on running over here. And I can't really see any real enemies. I can see some pigmen down there. Um, he's just here. Hello, guys. Um, but yeah, and I can see one block of quartz over there, but I can see quite a few little bits down here. But let's just go and take out this magnum cube. Oh, no. I forgot about that. Um, and but I think with these guys, the like even the baby versions can hurt you which the good thing about slime uh, slimes are that they uh, their babies don't hurt you um, but that doesn't uh, actually apply to the magma cubes even though they're pretty much the exact same in every other way so this looks slightly different um, I think they look way more menacing but look if I stand next to this guy I don't know can they not hurt you I don't think he can hurt you then can he Okay, let's go down here, because he, he seems to be having a little bit of an issue getting to me. Oh no, they can hurt you, okay. Let, uh, let's just go and take the skeezer out. Um, and let's just run over here. And maybe getting some magma might be a good call, uh, just in case uh, we actually need any. But the good thing is about this world is we've got to keep inventory on it pretty much at all times, unless there's a war going on which is currently forbidden because I am building stuff and I don't want that to get in the way. Uh, so let's just take this guy out quickly. Oh no, this guy made four. Uh, so let's just... Wait, why did he make four and the other one only made two? And I forgot that that hurts you. Uh, but while I'm here, I might as well just quickly go and grab a little bit of this. And I'm making a spectacular muck up of this. Um, but yeah, so, uh, because it's in the nether, oh my goodness, because it's in the nether, we need to be really careful of lava, oh damn, okay, 
Um, <laughs> that was a short trip to the nether, wasn't it? So yeah, luckily we do have keep inventory on, otherwise that would be everything gone. Um, so yeah, let's uh, run back down here and let's go and go back into the nether because that did not go to plan whatsoever. So let's try and be a little bit more careful because I didn't realize there'd be lava down there. Um, so yeah, I probably should have checked. And hang on a sec. Oh, ruin. I thought one of the lights was turned off on, like, in my hallway. But they're probably not. It's probably just, like, some, uh, some other block in the wall for some reason. But, that, I just saw that. And, ooh, did their eyes glow red now? Yeah, did their eyes glow red now when they open them? Or is that just some weird glitch? Because that, I'm not sure whether I like that or not. Or have they always done that and it's just me being a complete lemon? And I cannot fi uh, bounce these fireballs back. I'm being absolutely terrible today. And I think I'm going to have to run. Um, otherwise I'm going to die yet again. Um, so let's just run over here. Um, just try and sort of weave in and out of this place. And there's another ghast over there. I really need to just try and get... Um, some good shots off on it and then I need to try and get my health up but I need my hunger ah no why do I keep dying today this is probably the worst like we're literally like five minutes into the video and I've died twice already that is how bad I am at going into the nether in minecraft um, admittedly that time was just a little bit of bad luck because I literally ran into two ghasts straight away um, but yeah, it was still a bit bad. And yeah, they are off. Why are they off? Is there no... Oh, hello. Um... Uh... Oh, there's a thing. There's a lever there. So if I pull this lever... Okay. I'm not sure why that was like that, but hey. Yeah, that that's like the only problem within this mountain is like, I've accidentally done it too close together, even though it's such a big mountain. So like, um, like a lot of the rooms are so close to each other, so you can literally break two blocks and go into the next room. So yeah, that that is a tiny bit of an issue, but it's okay, I guess. Um, but let's just try and get some sword shots on him. Where's the hitbox? Where's the hitbox on this guy? That is unfair right there. Um, I think I'm going to have to run from this once again. However, not run towards that other gas. But I'll handle that guy terribly, but better than before. And can I get this? Oh, yes, one shot. Nicely done. And I've only got four hours left. Um, so it might be worth going to a nether fortress because sometimes, like, they join in with the land. And there is definitely a nether fortress in this world. But I can't remember where it is in the world. Um, so right, let's try and bounce this guy's thing back. That went absolutely horrifically. Let's try and do it again. Let's not try and do that. Let's abort. Let's run over here because it's going terribly and I'm going to die again. Oh no, I'm not. I just about made it. Oh no, there's another one. There is a another one just there, and ah, oh, this is another port, uh, another fortress. Sorry, not another portal. Um, right, so let's try and uh, if I try and dig into here for now, then just uh, look behind me and go and place these. Then there we go. We <laughs> we are in a little bit of safety right now. So I'm not sure whether the best thing to do from here would be to just try and like pile, uh, dig straight upwards and just try and because these are in one of the legs of it and I assume I'm probably completely wrong here let me just try and break to the outside okay so I assume if I can just have a quick glimpse through here yeah this will take me to the actual fortress itself so it's going to be really dark in here but hey so I'm facing upwards currently so I'm gonna dig away at this and I can barely see a thing you might be able to you might not be able to because normally 
I change around the contrast a little bit, but I'm not placing anything anymore uh, in my videos. So you might be able to see something, you might not be able to see something, but I cannot see a thing. I can see like my pickaxe moving and stuff. I can see the bricks moving. Um, but yeah, I can barely see anything. So yeah, it is exceptionally dark in here. So what I might do in a minute is, there we go, facing back upwards. Okay, there we go. Let me just place this down. And, oh, there we go. Okay, we are literally here then. Um, it's literally just this bit here. So, oh wait, was it? Oh no. Is this not like a, oh, there we go, okay. <laughs> Okay, there we go. That panicked me for a little bit there. And, oh no. I'm going to have to run through these wither skeletons. Oh, nope. This has not gone very well. Not gone very well at all, in fact. Uh, one of them still running after me. But not if I run away from it. Uh, oh no. Okay, okay then. Okie dokie. That went absolutely horrifically. So what I might do is I might just quickly block this off here um, and just block this off there and just place this down there and then try and uh, dig out of here a little bit this way. Um, Peekaboo. <laughs> um, so there was some quartz up there. Uh, I could always try and just go up and do that, but there's some quartz right here actually, so I might as well just gather this while I'm here. Uh, I don't really need any soul sand right now, I don't really have any plans to battle the wither. Actually I think I said I would uh, battle the wither at some point, um, but I'm probably not going to do that right now just because that'll take a while. Um, we could even do like a mini like series within the community series of trying to get the wither skills and stuff to do that. I think that could be quite fun. Um, but yeah, so let's just try and gather this. Nope, we're too short. So if I just go and pile up some blocks there, um, and then just take uh, these quartz with me. Um, so there we go. And I might as well uh, just go and gather up this dirt again. Uh, just because I'm going to run out at some point. I suppose I could always ru uh, run. I suppose I could always use uh, the nether rack. But however, this is an exceptionally dangerous position to be in right now. Um, because there's a ghast over there. He's firing at me, so he knows I'm here, obviously. Um, so let me just hide around here, I guess. Um, and keep an eye on him. Let's absolutely boo boo it out of there because there is a wither skeleton and he looks like he's angry at me. Didn't do anything to you, skeleton. Ah, oh, lava. Okay, so I should not be safe. There's still a ghast. Um, and there's another one down there just spawned. Okay, okay, okay. This is absolutely terrible right now. Um, so how about if we run down here, then there should be no uh, real space for a ghast to be able to fit through. Oh no, he can still shoot me through there though. Um, I think maybe we've given him the slip, but probably not. Have we? Um, hello, Mr. Ghast, you there? I think we've given him the slip. I think we're fine. For now, at least, anyway. Um, so let's quickly go and gather up this quartz. Uh, just sticking out this side of the mountain here. Well, it's not really a mountain. Outside of the uh, sheer cliff face. Just like the one in the actual community world uh, over there. So let's go and gather this up. Nope. Can I not reach it? Okay. Looks like I can't. Um, so let's just pile up here and go and uh, gather up these things so oh damn look who's back okay has he seen me he has in fact seen me did he just fall over and die there we go that was quick and easy um, because they're, they're three blocks tall I believe and obviously players are only two blocks tall so yeah that's 
um like a pretty easy way of doing it if you just go through a block uh two block tall thing then you can get through but he can't um so let's just try and break through there so let's try and get back up here then so i think what it might be worth doing is how much nether right do i have i have it i have over a stack of it so i should be perfectly fine um so i'm going to start piling up here I should try and get onto here and then i can try and kill some skeletons because sometimes skeletons uh spawn on um the uh nether fortresses so yeah it should be a pretty nice way to try and get some arrows Let's try and fire back at some of these ghasts so there's a blaze there so let's try and quickly get him and then destroy this uh, i'm not going to destroy all of them because sometimes they come in useful uh, just to have one there however i'm going to destroy that one uh just because it's not really in a great position anyway so i saw a wither skeleton on the edge of this bridge over here but i think he's despawned um but i do however see some more uh quartz over there this is a, that is a lot of lava just going to make sure that there aren't anything shooting at me because if there are i'm going to go plummeting to my death um and i think at the end i think this is the end coming up uh not literally the end um but the end of this bridge coming up uh yeah so it goes down but that's not really of any use to me uh there's loads of quartz up there so i think that might be my next place to go but sadly i couldn't find any um skeletons which is oh speaking of which hello let's just try and take these guys out oh no they're shooting at me of course they are the skeletons that's what they do um and yes i did get some arrows i got three arrows overall so i guess that worked out fine uh seven arrows overall that's not going to make a world of difference but it's better than only having three uh four even sorry so yeah it's better but still not very good so let's just go and gather up any quartz that we can find up here uh because we don't need too much of it we only need like probably three maybe four blocks most however it's just handy to have more of it for the future uh but what i think i might do is i might um i'm gonna it's a bit risky but hey should be fine did i not grab that there we go uh is i'm gonna pile over to there i saw a ghast over there in the lava but he should be hopefully okay um so yeah what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pile over to here because there's some more quartz just over there and then i'm going to try and head back to the nether portal if needs be i can just uh jump into the lava and kill myself and just respawn at home because i'm not 100 percent sure on um thingy what's it called i'm not 100 percent sure on where the portal actually is oh my goodness holy goodness gracious me i'm dead what just killed me what on earth was that? I've got my death messages turned off, so I can't actually see what killed me. But was that like a gust or a blaze or something? I'm not sure. That absolutely terrified me. So, yeah, I think I'm going to end this video here. Uh, it was successful to a certain extent. Uh, but in other ways, it was really not successful. Uh, but hey, that's just the way things go sometimes. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching. The next video will be online next week. As always, it will be linked in the description once it is. And goodbye.